shot to the back. Forearm smash. And another one. How'd you like to be on the receiving end of that? Not at all. I'll tell you what, Brian. I've had my share of battles in the ring, out of the ring. But I'll tell you what, I won't want to get hit by any one of the four of these guys. And now, the referee once again arguing with Apollo. And Apollo is not doing Chicano or his team any favors. Oh my. The Egyptian giant pharaoh comes in and comes in hard. I wonder if Chicano is thinking maybe I should have kept those bookings. Oh, I'll tell you what, right now there's no quit in this guy whatsoever. Oh, look at this now. On the outside, we got a double team effort. Tag is made. Once again, referee not paying attention. The Australian tag rule was not being held at that time by Rick Fuller. He was about eight feet across the ring when he made that tag. And once again, the incompetency of this referee, but you know what? I'm starting to have second thoughts about this guy. He is all over Apollo, but he's starting to, uh, a little bias maybe, Brian. Well, you know, the giant Pharaoh claims that he ha can buy anybody. Maybe he slipped the referee a few bills. And Anything and everything can happen here on NWA on fire. And Rick big Fuller. Rick Fuller now, look at this. Oh. Methodical in his stalking. Chicano says hello to a big size 19. Say hello to my big friend. Oh, oh wow. Are we gonna see a camel clutch which will bring me into an Iron Sheik imitation? Oh, I hope so, I hope so. Only for my own entertainment, of course. Uh-oh, we're gonna see a legendary. Oh, look at this, look nope. at this. Actually, nope. no, he's bringing him up. Nobody wants to hear the Sheik except me and you. Oh, let me say it anyway. It's a variation of the camel clutch. Sheik in number one, American jambroni fool, Egyptian man. Tried to do camel clutch like me, Iranian's greatest champion, Iron Sheik number one. Thank you very much. Thank you, Sheik, for stopping by. It was a pleasure to have you <laughs> here in Portland, Maine. No Wait fun and games on the inside of the ring, though, as a double team mugging goes on on Chicano, much behind the referee's back, and much to the aggravation of the NWA on fire champion Apollo. Cover one. And that's it. And now some frustration being. You're actually being, seeing uh, Rick Fuller getting frustrated. Oh, sure. With the referee not being able to keep Apollo out of the ring. Oh, oh wow. wrenching back. Here. Really wrenching in on that back of Chicano. And the referee asking Chicano, do you want to give it up? And this crowd starting to respond, coming to life for Chicano. He's been in there for a long time. And Apollo has had enough and again, not doing himself or Chicano any favors. Look at this here. Oh. Oh, he got a running start. Oh, look at this. Is he going to be able Can to Can he make, make the tag? He's got it! Tag is made, Brian! He's got the tag to Apollo, but the referee didn't see it! The referee was too busy with Big Rick Fuller! Oh, Apollo's gonna knock his lights out! Apollo threatening to slap the referee, and I don't think he cares! And Big Rick Fuller laughing at the champion! The fans are livid here in Portland, Maine, right now, wanting to see Apollo get a piece of the giant pharaoh. Measuring Chicano, oh, right on the side of the head. The cover. Oh, that was close. Very close. Imagine if you didn't have to go down seven feet one to get down to make a cover. That could have been a three count. And now putting all his weight into that chin lock.
Brian, I'll tell you what, right now this crowd is hot and heavy. Well, what do you say? I think we're up against the break right now. We're going to have to take a little time out and a time in for these messages. Don't go away. NWA on Fire returns to Mexico, Maine at the Mexico Recreation Center Friday night, July 24th with a 7.30 p.m. start. See in action the 7'1 Giant Pharaoh, Heavyweight Champion Apollo, the Latin Hit Squad, Dynamite Tim Orsons, Makua, and all the NWA superstars. That special Friday night, Mexico, Maine at the Mexico Recreation Center. Be there. Brian, we're back with more NWA on fire. Now, are we going to see a tag right now? He's inches away from being able to reach Apollo, Brian. Tag, but we there got a tag! Is. Big Rick Fuller and Apollo. There's no love lost between the former friends, the former tag team known as Chaos and Destruction. And that's what we've got here in this tag team main event. Chaos and Destruction. A stunner! A stunner by Apollo! Rick Fuller has been rocked. What a chop! And now Apollo up on the second turnbuckle. Uh oh, and here comes the giant. Look at Farrell. this, though. From our view, we can see the giant. Oh, man. but here comes Chicano. He touched that big right hand. Drop kick to the knee. That took the wheel out. That took the big man down. Oh, and a low blow. And the referee calls for the bell. The referee has called for the bell, and I'm sure that that is an instant disqualification. Oh, Look at this, though. With the belt, Apollo lets the Pharaoh have it. That low blow was seen by the referee, Mundo. Uh-oh. Side slam by Fuller. Apollo didn't see that coming, though. He's choking him out here. He's choking him out with the championship. He's got the NWA on fire championship and he's choking the life out of Apollo. And now the Pharaoh is up and he's doing the same to Chicano. It has busted open here this week on NWA on fire. The crowd is in a stunned silence right now, Brian. There is a, a mass of destruction left in that squared circle. Rick Fuller can hold the belt up all he wants. He is not the heavyweight champion, but they certainly sent a message to Apollo here this week. Brian, I've never seen Apollo left laying on a mat before. I myself don't know what to say right now. They are going to need some medical attention. Oh, the Pharaoh spits on that fan sign. And the Pharaoh and Big Rick Fuller sending a giant message to Apollo. 